And good morning, everybody. And yes, we're here at Beer Can Island. Spend the night over here. Uh, and it's a beautiful morning, as usual, with gray skies. And the weather report said scatter showers and thunderstorms. That's why we didn't go to Bimini. So I'm learning, I guess, not to trust the Miami weather report. But it's all good. We'll make the best of it here in Miami at the sandbar. Have some fun today here. happened this morning that it hasn't happened to me in a very long time and it's actually I think the second time it ever happened to me that we anchored up to the island when it was uh, low tide so the back anchor was on uh, dry sand but as soon as the tide went up and, uh, and, and it reached where the anchor was it loosened up the ground and it made uh, the, the ground soft so with a water current, it actually moved my boat. So uh, now I learned to either tie to a tree or put a longer uh, rope on the anchor itself so it doesn't happen again. So I learned my lesson. Uh, gladly nobody was around. Uh, and the guy next to me kind of knocked on the boat. Uh, well, not next to me, but near me. Knocked on the boat and woke me up. So uh, lesson learned, but still a beautiful day here. Uh, Beer Can Island and we're gonna spend a day maybe at the island or at the sandbar. I don't know Wherever the wind takes us. It's one of those days Notice I'm here by myself because everybody's still sleeping and it's 8 30 in the morning, but it's good though because um, We went to sleep last night like around 12 30. So it was pretty late uh, But we did a little bit of fishing. We caught a few yellowtails and uh, red-eyed fish and I don't even know still I don't remember the name of the big red-eyed fish Good morning to you. What time is it? It is time for breakfast. Where at? Beer Can Island. This is what you call breakfast for the beef. That's a practice. Oh, but looking like I hop eggs. This is our island eggs. Island mounds. Island mounds. Island mine eggs mine. Ooh, can I have some crackers? I guess you can't ask for anything better. Ham and eggs. On the water. Very good, very good man. Thank you, ma'am. And now it's time to eat. Eat that breakfast. All right, you can't touch that ball. What's this? Hot. Look at that. Julie's waiting for breakfast too. That was funny. Feels like a raccoon. A hairy raccoon. No bad idea. Look for this. Getting a full course breakfast. Ham, eggs, crackers. If you guys haven't tried frying the ham, try it. It tastes like a bacon ham, I guess. It tastes pretty good. We like it a lot. Right, buddy? So, this is what you do when it's too hot to be outside and you just have breakfast. So you go in the cabin with the AC. See, I always tell you, people get used to the good things, not the bad things. So AC is a good thing. And right now we're enjoying it because uh, we're too full to be outside in the hot weather. So, uh, we're gonna chill for a little bit here and then we're gonna go pick up some friends and have some fun at the sandbar. Right? Right.
pick up some friends and head over to the sandbox. Taking a little cruise through the intercoastal. Well, not the intercoastal, but to the channel to get to her house. Sausages, just turkey burgers.
Dunbar, ¿es So what time is it? It's time to get that ice cream. Dun 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 dun. Viste? Viste qué pasó por ahí? <laughs> Look at the water, how clear it is. I don't know if you can see it. Can you see my feet? Look at this. choice now we're here so we're staying here fight it out another storm at the sandbar they go the hydro chilling on the side scary boy looks like we're gonna get struck by a massive massive storm here okay this was fresco channel the weather channel at the sandbar today Hurricane season. <laughs> wow, it looks ugly. We're here, and the, and the waves, the waves, the winds are going 100 miles, 100 plus. <laughs> nah, it's, it's, it's pretty bad. It looks ugly, but it's not that bad. It's not that bad. Hopefully, it's a lot of wind, so hopefully uh, the wind pushes them. Hey! <laughs> Getting the boat re-anchored and situated. So, okay. How are you surviving the storm? It's so cold. Yeah, you. Yeah, it's pretty bad. Now it's coming hard. Now it's coming hard. I know. Ouch. Feels like needles. Look at the rafters. <laughs> 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 Inside. Yeah, 
paddle boarders. Oh, they actually sit down. Ah, that's smart. I thought they were gonna stand up. No, they're actually standing up. No, they're gonna stand up. Here in a rainy day, in a rainy day. Oh, 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 yeah. oh, Red out here, man. Yeah, rain or shine. This is life. Let's go. The first YouTuber out there. Go. Even Yuli got wet. Poor Yuli. Poor Yuli got wet in the storm. And it's still raining, so we had to go. Go home. Go home. So that was the perfect storm. Yeah, it's cold, huh? That was the perfect storm. Oh, okay. We got that dryer and the system. Well, like you noticed, the weatherman was halfway wrong or halfway right because it, did, it wasn't a bad Saturday, but Sunday after 4 o'clock, the weather got really bad. But I guess you can't really predict Mother Nature. It was okay because we still got to enjoy the sandbar and had a little bit of fun in the rain. And now we're dropping off our friends here and then we're heading home. But let us know what do you guys thoughts in playing in the rain at the sandbar. Would you have left or stayed like we did? <laughs>